It's Black History Month and we're continuing our series of stories of influential African Americans right here in our area. Tonight, Andrea introduces us to a professor at Mississippi State who makes music and memories with his students. She joins us now with that story. Andrea. Winston, Dr. Gary Packwood, like most musicians, has a real passion for his craft. He's using that passion to train the next generation of music teachers. I think there's there's something about um, the pulse of a tempo, mm -hmm. fast, slow, medium. that we all can sort of migrate to, you mm -hmm. know, here. and I think that's what brings us together. It's, it's an unknown, you know, um, something that brings us together. One, two, two, and... Dr. Gary Packwood has been using music to bring people together for more than three decades as a professor in university music departments and in venues across the country and all over the world. I go to South America oh, a wow. lot, to Brazil. So mm -hmm. I've been to Brazil maybe eight or nine times mm -hmm. it's conducting. Uh, so there's a teaching aspect where I'll teach students from all over Brazil for a week or so and it'll culminate in a performance. Packwood has been at Mississippi State for the past 11 years and is the director of choral activities in the music department. He says teaching has always been his passion. I never wanted to be a performer. Really? Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. I just didn't get the... I didn't get all the feels okay. that I do when I see a student uh, achieve. When I, even now, after 31 years, mm -hmm. when I see a student achieve, that's what gives me the feels. One of his greatest joys, directing the MSU Singers, a choral group of about 50 students, and not all of them are music majors. So it's open to any student at okay. Mississippi State University. So you don't have to be in the music department? No, okay. not at all. We have mm. several engineering students uh, that sing in that group, <laughs> and we love having them. Packwood says part of instructing and directing this group is helping these singers gain a deeper appreciation for different genres of music. Whether it's uh, and teaching them the discipline of it or accolades or whatever we have to do. Mm -hmm. So I think the best way we can show our, pa our teach our students to have passion is to show them our passion. And he shows them with every beat, every note, all in harmony. And my students never know what to expect when mm -hmm. they walk into a room, even after 31 years. Mm -hmm. I'm still hopefully on fire. And um, I think they, they feel that. That's an impressive group of students there. You can hear the MSU singers perform Tuesday night at First Baptist Church in Starkville at 7 o'clock. The choir will be presenting a special Black History Month concert featuring songs both sacred and secular by African-American composers.